One of the privileges of working as a journalist is the opportunity to meet and to interview well-known people. One of those opportunities came in 1984, the same year the Detroit Tigers won the World Series. I was invited to a White House luncheon with President Reagan, and later that month I sat down for an interview with him. Recently, I came across the video of that interview, and I got to speculating about how it might have come out if my buddy Groucho had done the interview. So I gave him a shot at it. Hello, fans. As you know, I've been negotiating with the old guy for a better deal. I mean, I do all these videos, and so far he hasn't paid me one dime. Oh, he does give me a few extra treats and an extra tummy rub or two, but frankly, I think I'm getting cheated. So I'm taking my case right to the top. President Reagan, do you agree that the old guy is ripping me off? Now, I hope that in the coming negotiations, certainly government should not interfere as a former union president myself. I believe that these problems are between management and labor to work out. Wait a minute, Mr. President. You certainly got involved with those flight controllers. You fired all of them. Yes. On the other hand, I hope that there will be not only fairness, as there should be, but some restraint also uh, in the negotiations. Now, obviously, I can't vote for you. I'm only a cat, although I understand that in Chicago even dead people can vote. I'm not going to inject myself into the middle of that battle, but I don't think it's fair for anyone to suggest that they have not uh, benefited. I know you're trying to control inflation, but squeezing a few bucks out of the old guy, surely that's not going to affect the national debt. We have had continuous deficits for 50 years. I've been one of the loudest voices, I guess, back over the years in saying that this was a false policy for this country to follow. Well, Mr. President, thank you for your time. Do you have any final words for the old guy and me as we begin these talks? All I can say is, uh, <clears throat> bless you boys. Bless you boys.